So hey guys, hello, what is going on? My name is Josh, thank you very much for tuning into today's video. In this video today, what are you guys watching in 2015 gaming setup and entertainment system of my room? But anyway guys, let's get into this. I know I've been saying I was going to do this for ages now, but guess what, it's finally here. My room is all done. But anyway guys, not wasting your time anymore. Let's get down to the business. Let's get into this video. So here there guys, first of all is going to be my entertainment setup as you can see on screen. It's nothing really special but like keep it small, keep it clean, keep it simple and like it's got really some nice effects to it. Okay, so the first thing is my LED Samsung 42 inch 3D TV. This is a smart TV and the picture that comes off of this TV is absolutely amazing. The next is my Minecraft Iron Sword, some of people like Syndicate, Ashley Murray, Ali A. All of her, all of them, other like awesome YouTubers, and it's like a memory thing. Just look at it and smile. Right next is my uh, LED remote for my LEDs in the back bit of my TV. This remote is so small, it is so cool, and like the remote doesn't look like doesn't look boring. There's like so much colors now as well, and the stuff LED, these LEDs can do is absolutely amazing. As you see, guys, I'm changing the color right now, and the colors look like, literally. There's a wide span of colors. The colors are amazing. I choose red because red matches my gaming setup, and the modes that these LEDs can go on are crazy. As you can see, look at this. It's true, guys. It, these LEDs are absolutely amazing. All the links to these projects can be down in the description below, so check them out. Right guys, moving on to my GoPro Hero 3 Plus. This thing is literally so small, it fits in the palm of my hand perfectly, but the quality it comes out of the actual GoPro is absolutely outstanding. I absolutely love it. Next is my Wii. Don't know why I have a Wii. I've had this Wii for ages and just been sitting there gathering dust. I don't know, I might get rid of it soon. The next is my Skybox and the Wii motion sensor. Moving on to the right side, that's basically it for my entertainment setup then, is my uh, Ray-Bans, I'm going to show you these right now, as you can see there's my Ray-Bans, I don't know what model these are guys, I'm very sorry for that, but I'm pretty sure if you go on the website you're going to see them. Ray-Bans are quite expensive as well, but uh, like the money you pay for them like, literally is so worth it guys, I do recommend you invest in a pair of Ray-Bans. And yeah guys, so that's my entertainment setup, and let's move on to my like left side of the room, and then move on to my shelves. Right, so guys, this is my uh, wardrobe where all the bitches are kept. I would open it to show you all the clothes inside, but I can't because there's too much bitches in there at the moment, as you can see. Watch this now. Ah! So yeah, guys, just going to keep that closed for a second. Don't want any bitches escaping. <laughs> Alright, so guys, moving on to my shelves, you got the Minecraft Steam with the diamond lock next to it. Uh, the top shelf, you got uh, all the DVDs, movies, and all that. On the bottom shelf, you've got my scarf, you've got my Call of Duty Ghost Band, my Insomnia Band, and the Minecraft Steve. Oh, they're looking cool. Top left shelf is my iPhone 6, Nintendo games, Turtle Beach, Bravo, headset, I believe. Not too sure. El Garo Game, Captain Card, HD, uh, Blue Yeti Mic Stand, and Xbox One games. Moving down onto my setup now is uh, my. Uh, what's it called? Oh, yeah, iPhone 3 GS. Right, so this is the iPhone 4 GS in my hand. Literally, I don't know why I still have these, but it's like sort of a memory thing, like all the generations. It's my iPhone 3 GS. Picking the weight of this compared to my iPhone 6 Plus is absolutely crazy. And then you just got my uh, iPad here, just in here. iPads are just cool, but they get pretty boring sometimes. Alright, so next is my Gunner Optics. If you're not Gunner Optics, are, they uh, reduce strain of your eyes when you're gaming, editing. Basically anything to do with computers, it stops the strain on your eyes and literally I wear them when I, when I play games like Call of Duty, Advanced Warfare, uh, Minecraft and all that, basically any games is so good to wear them, like it, it, after a while you don't feel like you got them on but literally they're so cool. Right, next to that is my Xbox One as you can see, uh, Xbox One I might get a PS4 soon, like in a couple of weeks and all that but I don't know yet, and moving on to that is my two Yama monitors. I believe these are 23 inch. I believe I'm not too sure. I think they're 23 inches and Yeah, guys the monitors give off a uh, one millisecond response time I believe so that is really cool as well under that you've got my speakers all the links to your products are gonna be in the description to check them out And then you've got my Xbox one connect as well Right so guys moving on this is my CM storm trigger Z keyboard with the armrest connected to it as well as you can see this keyboard is absolutely huge but guys this is one of the best keyboards i ever had this is a mechanical keyboard as well 
So guys, if we're looking for a decent keyboard at the start as well, I took my turn to get one of these. And it's just my normal CM Storm mouse. It's got different profiles, you can change the colours and all that guys. And you can change the sensitivity of the mouse as well by using the DPI. Uh, it goes 1,632 and 8200 as well. Guys, so yeah, that mouse is really cool. Next we got my Logitech C. 615 it gives a 1080p camera and it absolutely is amazing on that you've got the astro a40s neon color edition headset these absolutely amazing 7.1 surround sound system as well uh moving on to the left you've got the road mic stand as you see let me just get this in focus uh there it is in focus as you see this is the road mic stand uh this mic stand is absolutely really cool as well like it's it just looks so cool but like the lead on the mic stand isn't too good, but I could improve on that. But then you got connecting it to my Blue Yeti mic, it is so sexy. I'm using this for this audio now, guys. It just sounds absolutely amazing. So guys, below that you've got my Astro mix out, which connects to my Astro A40 headset as well. Uh, below that you've got my Scuff Gaming controller. If you don't know what Scuff is, basically you've got the paddles on the back. Mine is A on the left and B on the right, but I use B as knife. So when you're playing like stuff like CODs, like COD gamers and all that, it gives you a way advantage on the enemy, basically helps you destroy them. Next is my day one edition for my Xbox One. This is the Xbox One controller day one edition. I actually got my Xbox on day one as well. Uh, moving on, you've got my DX Racer chair. Right guys, literally I broke my other chair, but this chair is so comfy. Right, underneath that you've got my PC. Uh, the case I believe is a Scout 2 Advanced. This case is so sexy guys. On the left as well, you've got the glass panel. But unfortunately there isn't much light in my PC. I just got red dim lights coming out of it from the fans and all that. But yeah, I can't really see it in it. Right, next on my bed is my MacBook Pro Late 2014 Edition. This, guys, is absolutely amazing. It is so slick to use. When you're designing on it as well, oh my god, guys. This is probably one of the best things for designing on Macs. It is so smooth. It's so fast. And the backlit of the Apple logo as well just looks so sexy. Looks so professional when you're pulling it out and showing your friends. So yeah, guys, I really do hope you have enjoyed this video. There's my setup and all that. It does look pretty cool. I'm very happy with it. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Anyway, my specs for my PC, I know I didn't really tell them. My specs are going to be down below in the description. And if you enjoyed this video, why not give it a like rate and why not show some support to me? But first of all, I want to say, like, thanks for everyone who subscribed to me. I've reached 1,000 subscribers and this was my 1,000 subscriber special. So yeah, guys, I really do hope you have enjoyed this video. You are all amazing. Like... Literally, YouTube and all that means a lot to me, and you guys are just making like my hobby become like better. But yeah, guys, I just like to say thank you for a thousand subscribers. Hopefully, this channel can progress and become a lot more like awesome and all that. But yeah, guys, you guys are awesome. I really hope to see you in my next video. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe, leave a like button. I'm going back into my natural habitat with all the bitches. Anyway, guys, my name's been Josh. Hope to see you in my next video. Bye. -bye.